Happy New Year. And it's after the new year, we're gonna have some better lighting. Ah, much better, right? Man, beginning of year has some shitty, shitty ass freaking everything. Lighting, audio, camera, everything. Oh no. <laughs> the video, I don't know if you guess, is work. Like, what is work? Because basically throughout, I don't know, since I was like, I don't know, 10 till now, I still don't have an idea what really work is. But I get it. On, I'm kind of getting it. It's like it's true. The more the older you get, the wiser you get. I guess that concept is really it's actually true. I started working when I was like 16 years old. So I was working. All I was told basically was to learn to work and do your job. But I never really understood what that really meant. What like what did what does it mean to really work? And it's, it's really complicated. It is work is work. Poor me, what it is. But in reality, it's work is basically dedicating your time and effort to something either you don't feel like it's less value or you feel like it's valuable to you. Like apparently, you know, for instance, YouTube videos is very valuable for me, so that's why I put my work into it. So I basically, you know, get the new lights and the and new editing software whenever I get a chance to buy some equipment. But this is what I do, personally, because this is basically my type of job, basically my own version of working for me. It really, the work comes in many different forms, animations, even live streaming. Some people think that some people think that's just easy, but in reality, it's not easy. You're sitting from five to ten hours a day, and if you have an audience, you gotta start from somewhere. You gotta build the audience right up from there, and then that's putting work in there. Like, I think my ninja's been doing it for seven years now, and that man's really putting that work. Like I said, there's a lot of celebrities, even artists. You don't think that's work? That's it's really is work. Like I said, there's so many like there's so many things about work, and it's crazy like that everything is you really think about it is work. Just just getting up, I don't know, washing and washing the dishes, that's working. It's not stupid how it is, but that's really working. Even though chores can actually impact how you work, because like so one of my job I sweep, I can I have to clean up and I have to do something. That's, I learned that from doing chores. I learned to sweep from chores. And that's, so I basically, that mentality of sweeping, just over to my actual daily life, me, me working. That's, that's another version of working. So it's like every little, every little thing you do is considered working. Even just recording a video, five for 10 minutes, five to 10 seconds, that's, that's the seconds out of your life that you did just towards something else. I could have done it laying down, going to sleep. No, I'm recording a video because this is something I like to do constantly. That is considered putting in work, and this is the original working how it is. And the people, the people that hate on your work, your goals, and that don't like to see you, you thrive and like your work. Fuck. So like I say, it's fuck each one of them fucking haters. Because at the end of the day, you put in your work and they're not. They're complaining about how they can't do this, they hate their job. You're complaining like, bitch. I'm gonna get my dream together. What you know about this work, nigga? No, no I'm not saying that. <laughs> Don't say, say it. Like, say it. I didn't fucking say that shit. Okay. But still. Yeah, this is this. It's all about print work. Every, every little. Damn, fucking fireworks. You, you, I know you. Can y'all hear this in the background? It's fucking New Year's Eve right now. Oh, New Year's. New Year, 2019. Oh, yeah, 2019. Happy New Year, everybody. 2019. Yeah, so basically, this is. This is really where work is. Work is really everything you do that it takes time. That's considered work. I, that's how I see work is. Every precious moment of your time that you dedicate your life to is considered working. And that is a short version of it. And I don't know how long this video was, but this itself is considered work. Like, you have to understand, like, when you actually practice and practice, it gets easier. Just like a job. It usually, take, it usually take people a year to learn how to do their job. That is putting work into your job to learn how to do something so it becomes easier for you, for, easy for you to do. That is all considered work. And more or less is, what can you say? You put in that ground, you put in that work, you, it benefits you in the long run. I mean, if, you, if you're working on a dead end job, then that's just your problem right there. That's your fault for not putting extra work, I guess. Because, you know, you know, you know stories that people say, I work this job and I get nothing in return and it just, oh, I feel like I'm not fulfilling my life. Yeah, 
as a sack is gonna happen when you go to a job that you know personally, you're not gonna move up and you're not going nowhere in it. You're gonna feel you're gonna feel like shit. And it sucks to say that, but that's the truth. That's the reality, that's fact. That if you want to be happy in it, you gotta pursue happiness. Most people don't they're not grateful living in America. And if you look at other countries, we don't get we don't get opportunities to basically go for our goals. People don't realize that how 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 hard it is, but how easy it's at the same time. The more the more the internet gets bigger, the more technology gets bigger, we have more and more chances. Think about that. 20 years back, Jay-Z and okay, I don't know, Lil Wayne, they had to do mixtapes and shit like that to get their get their music through. Now, it's social media, they, bro. I put it, I can put a freaking rap music, I could have, not rap, a uh, freaking music video, drop it today, an artist might find it the very next day and call me to come sign to a record deal. That's how easy it is, but yeah, it's hard to do most people think. Because most people think, oh, they're just they oh, like, I don't know, uh, who's, who's this rapper? Skim has slum, Skim has slum, dog. Most people say he's been, he's been rapping for like six months, but now he's been rapping for like three, four years. And, because he's, he's, he's been relevant for, for a couple of months, but he's been rapping for longer than that. And that's, that's, that's people don't really realize how hard it is really to get into that, your field or whatever you want to get into. Like I said, in the U.S., in the U.S. in general, or I don't know how other countries are, but for the U.S. at least, anyone has the right to pursue of happiness if they choose it. Like you literally decide your own fate. That's that's you don't You decide it. Every little thing you decide, you're fated. If you want to work at no offense, I'm just gonna put it right now. McDonald's. No offense, anybody. You work McDonald's. If you personally hate that job to the core. But you sit there and complain instead of looking for another job, you're the problem, not the job. You're the problem. You, you have you have plenty of time to look for another job. You have plenty of time to look for another job. But you sit there and complain and bitch. And what does it get you? Nowhere. It doesn't get you nowhere. Oh yeah, all that work you put in is meaningless if you're not happy, right? You can, pull, you, can pull, you, can, you can be there for 20 years. And you complain about the next guy because he decided I'm gonna get a good job. But oh, why do you want, man? Why do you, why does he get to leave? Well, why am I here? Well, you're here because you choose to be here. And that point, but that's how it is. Most people realize when sometimes sometimes the work is meaningless. Most people realize, and that's the reason working because you gotta really develop yourself and show that I'm gonna work hard for something I enjoy. Not work out for someone else because that place is up. I mean, think about it. If I'm, if I'm a businessman, I don't, I don't care if you work in my company here or not. If I get you to stay, I don't care. But if you choose, if you choose to stay, that's your own. That's that's, that's whatever you gotta do. You talk to me. You're not about that. You talk. You you basically, I was talking. You talk to stuff at night, wondering why you hate your job. It's not your fault. I mean, it is your fault, but I mean, it's not your fault. I mean, once you apply. Kind of asking, you know, you're kind of asking for it. But the moment you apply, the moment you just you try your own things. So every, everything's in your hands. And now if you're gonna get a cycle of basically not working for that company, you gotta basically say, well, to this company that pays you more. God, I see, I see many people who've been in a job for 20 years, and that job has gone bankrupt. And it's crazy because they only have to do that one particular job. And it sucks that time that time and effort is wasted. If you can find a job that's guaranteed and secure, that's a perfect way to do it. But if not, that work is meaningless, right? It sucks. It sucks to say that, but sometimes work is meaningless. If it's in if, if in the long run it's, it is not worth it. Well, this is why it's about putting work. Every moment, everything you do is considered work. That's all I gotta say. Mine is Faded. This is Faded Videos. Hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and also follow on me on Facebook at Faded Videos. And I will see you guys next time.